So maybe you live in a brick house, or maybe like my house, you have a portion of it that's brick. Well, we're sitting here with, with Rick, uh, which rhymes with brick, by the way, of Somerset painting. Uh, good to see you, Rick. And, and the question of the day is, uh, can I just paint directly on a brick? And you know, if how, sh how should I prepare the brick? How, how do you approach painting brick versus wood or vinyl? Well, first of all, uh, it's fun that more people are painting their brick. They see these Saturday shows and like guys in particular, like I'm not painting my brick, period. Forget about how to paint it or can you paint it? They hate yeah. that, they hate that idea. We have to tell them, you can't get the dang paint off. So a lot of times I'll go around and show them the paint job where somebody already got a little bit of drip of paint on their brick. You can't get it off. So how do you paint brick? Typically you do not need a primer. Companies will try to sell you the primer, but if it's got that straw feel or it's um, got a lot of texture to it, yeah. you can't get normal, a good masonry paint on. So now if it's soft brick like my house and it kind of, you can kind of take your finger across and get some dust or it's really super hard, uh, shiny because it's been a, it's a sort of a baked brick, I think, and it's shiny. Yeah. The paint's not going to stick on those. So those require a really heavy duty masonry primer. Sometimes it's called a conditioner and you can tint that and get it to the color you're going to go towards and it will help so you're uh, you're priming it at the same time it's the ultimate in preparation but um yeah that's that's about it make sure it's power washed make sure it's clean yep yeah can i hey can i assume it, it just takes one coat if you're going to do brick like new brick that has never been painted before Great one coat question. Do it? yeah it's like aluminum siding you're not protecting it's not like wood right you're trying to protect that wood from rotting so when you do right. aluminum siding, you don't want a lot of a lot of paint on that. You just want to get the right color. And then when you do brick, the same thing. You don't need a lot. You're not protecting it from anything. Right. You're just changing the color. So um, yeah, just put it on as thin as possible. Now also chimneys will peel. People need to know that. 50% of the chimneys in Michigan anyways, above the roof line, if you paint them because they're hollow and the, the weather comes in and out of that chimney a little bit somehow. Yeah, okay. Um, the airflow, it will peel. So people call up, they're a little disappointed in their chimney peel. So we have it in our paperwork. Hey, if you're going to do it, you might expect that to peel. That's about hey, all well, it is. But mostly, yeah, go ahead. Well, just one last question. Then. Okay, so let's assume somebody already has painted brick and now they want to change the color. So they're putting the paint on the paint. Is there any special prep work they have to do in that case? Yeah, we. Yeah, that's a good question too. There's a powerful power washing, um, oh, uh, what's a ceramic tip. It looks like a grenade launcher and you can go around and uh, we'll charge people extra if they've got that mess on their hands of somebody didn't do it right um and just blast the heck it's like sandblasting with water okay it's a water right. blasting tip and we can prep that sucker and then maybe a little bit of wire brushing and you're good to go okay but here's, cool. the, big, That's... here's the big thing randy people need to know they can paint their brick if it's ugly brick or cement color brick and it's not doing anything for you or you hate it paint the brick it changes okay. everything and makes houses look like mansions. You know, it's funny too, you, you mentioned this, because some, some brick isn't, isn't attractive. Some of it isn't, some of it's beautiful, but if you have a house that it isn't, as Rick said, you can paint the brick and it, uh, you can try it yourself or you can have the pros do it. Um, if the pros, if you want the pros out there, well, there may not be any better pro than Somerset painting. Rick and his crew are great. They've been doing this a gazillion years. Rick, have you been painting? Is hey, okay? hey. I, I'm hey. gonna age you a little bit, there. <laughs> but they're great. Hey, if you're not at the website already, check it out. There's a lot of great videos there. It's at somersetpainting.com. And uh, Rick, as always, thanks a lot for the input. Always get good information from you, man.